I think it's an interesting point, um, and I think you've probably put your finger on the right answer uh, where America is concerned. Where Turkey is concerned, I don't know that much about it. I do know that um, Ataturk set up modern Turkey as a secular state, as the founding fathers of America set up the United States as a, as a, secular, as a secular country. However, I suspect that the similarity may end there. And the reason why Turkey is the top most, or the bottom of most of the countries that, you're, that you mention, may be because it's the only, so to speak, Western European country, not Western, but European, quote, country, which is Islamic. Um, however, um, in the case of the United States of America, I think you may very well be right that it, it could be precisely because it, was, because it is a secular country uh, and because it doesn't have a church of the state, it doesn't have an, an official, official religion. In Britain, where we have an official religion, the Church of England, and the Queen is the head of the Church of England, um, the Church of England officiates at state funerals and weddings and things like that, religion has become boring. Uh, whereas in America, it's just the opposite. Religion is exciting. It, religion has become free enterprise. Religion has become uh, a, an, an open marketplace where churches compete with each other, mega churches compete with each other for custom and for tithes, tax-free tithes. Uh, and I think that could very well be, be the, uh, the reason. Um, there is another possible reason in the case of America, which is that it is of, compared to, Europe, to Western European countries, it has a rather poor welfare system, some states more than others, and Obama's doing something about that. And there has been observed an actual correlation between the level of welfare support that a country has, looking after the sick, the old, etc. Uh, the level of welfare support is positively correlated with lack of religious belief. So one replaces... Well, yeah. it, you, it, you, you could say something like, um, in those places where um, people feel vulnerable and, um, and uh, unsupported by the state, uh, in those places they may turn to religion uh, out of a sort of desperation. Um, the, the, the research that I'm talking about is done by one Gregory Paul, if you want to look it up, P-A-U-L.